And I could point out all the things about how bad this life can seem But we work hard, we making it for work motion on everything What's up everybody? <coughs> Welcome back to Four Words Monday It's your boy Valet, Delroy, D-Rock I'm here back with you again, live from the underground Now, first of all, let's get this out of the way I'm on break and that's why I don't have none of my uniform stuff on, so don't worry about that. But I'm also always on duty because I work at night. Uh, I can always be on call. So I'm glad you're back with me. I'm glad you're hanging out. So listen, I think it's week 44. Um, and today we're just going to be quickly um, talking about asking questions, okay? And uh, the real title of this will be, you're asking the wrong questions. Now, not only this week, but for years and lifetime, um, I've always struggled with answering some people's questions, depending on which question it is, right? You ever have somebody uh, ask you the same question every day and you feel like you don't know how to answer it because you do the same thing every day, right? So it's almost like talking to a brick wall, but that's what we want to talk about tonight, right? Uh, Valet Delroy, Living to be Known, Week 44, you're asking the wrong questions. Um, and this doesn't just apply for um, interpersonal relationships when you communicate, but it applies when you're communicating at job interviews, when you're communicating with uh, strangers, when you're in a new environment, when you're communicating with people that you're just trying to get to know, um, when you're uh, hanging out with friends, right? with family, right? Questions sometimes depend on the relationship that you have with somebody. Sometimes it depends on the situation that you're in at the moment. Sometimes it depends on uh, the setting, right? Whether it's a work setting or a group setting or a fun setting or serious or private, whatever it is, um, the idea is that we want to ask the right questions um, at the right times for the right situations, right? And sometimes our communication errors uh, come with each other. And sometimes we create communication uh, hindrances because we're asking all the wrong questions. So um, I know I don't have a lot of time and I can be called at any moment. So I just want to briefly go through some of these thoughts and briefly go through uh, some of these examples. OK, so living to be known, belief, knowledge, practice, relationship, communication, finance. Right. So when you ask questions. Uh, what's, what's the base belief behind that? Do you believe you're going to get an honest answer? Do you believe you're going to get an expected answer? Or do you think um, you really just don't know what somebody's going to say, and so that's why you're asking? So, case in point, um, you got who, what, when, where, and why questions, right? Um, and how, of course. Um, they all mean something. Who pertains to the person, the what pertains to the thing, the when pertains to the time, uh, the where pertains to the place, the how pertains to uh, how, right, how something is done, like how do you uh, build a bike, or um, how do you do your taxes, um, or you can say something like, how are you today? Now, we all understand that that is a generic way to greet somebody and basically see how they're doing, but have you ever thought about when you ask the question, how, like, how are you today? Like, how do I explain how I am? Right? I can explain what I am. I'm mad or I'm sad or I'm hungry. Um, I can explain where I am. I can answer that question. Um, I can explain what I am. Right? Um, I said that already. Um, but how? Right? You ever feel like you're talking to a brick wall um, because you're asking these questions? Right? Like, um... How are you today? Um, how's your job going? How's your job going? Um, how do you feel right now? Oh, what have you been up to? You know all these loaded questions that sometimes I just find so hard to answer like, man. What happened to asking real questions? What happened? I need. I mean, I think we really need to get this right. Um, 
our relationships will go so much further. Our communication will go so much further. Um, the results of what we really want are trying to get to will go so much further if we would just be what direct, right? We have direct questions and indirect questions. It's almost like, why would you ask me a question that you really don't care about just to try to figure out an answer to a question you're not willing to ask? I might have to say that again, right? Why would you ask me a question about something you really don't care about trying to figure out an answer to a question that you're really not willing to ask me, right? All right, welcome back. Sorry about that. I got a call, you know, got to stay on call. But real quick, I was just talking about why would you ask a question um, to get to an answer that you're really not asking the right question to get that answer from, right? A lot of people in relationships will, when they don't trust each other, they'll ask each other questions like, oh, where were you today? Oh, who are you with? Oh, what did you guys do? And what did you do after that? Like, nobody wants a detective. Nobody wants somebody who they're supposed to trust to ask them questions as if they're trying to get an answer that doesn't make any sense, right? Um, when you're at a job interview um, and they start asking you questions like, why do you want to work here? Uh, what makes you interested in our job? What, what are you willing to offer to the team, right? These are all questions that they really want to know and that they really want you to answer. Um, when uh, you're taking tests in school, usually they ask you questions that they want to know the answer for. Right. Just like we were saying that explanations are not answers. Right. And if you don't ask a real question, you won't get a real answer. Um, but the whole point I mean, the whole post is about asking the right questions. What do you want to know? Right. Who who do you want to know about? When are you asking about? Right. Why are you asking? Right. If you ask me how I'm. Um, Right? Ask me a real question, a how question. Um, the understanding is that a lot of times we're not getting the answers we want because we don't ask the right questions. Right? I don't know. I guess that last thought call threw me off. I'm all like in the mix and I hate that um, I didn't get this out to you guys earlier, but hey, here's some fun. I'm ballet 100%. You see what I do. Four words every day, all day. Hey, if you see this in the car in Chicago, holla at me. Honk the horn. You know what I'm saying? It's Valet Delroy, D Rock. I love you guys. Help me, help you, help me, right? That's what this is all about. Living to be known, growing, learning, right? What do we believe? What do we know? What do we do? How are our relationships? How's our communication? How's our finance? We're trying to ask better questions. We're trying to give better answers, right? Just something to think about, right? Are you asking the right questions or is somebody going to have to tell you you're asking the wrong question because you're getting the wrong answer? Who knows? Check me out. I love you guys. Stick with me. I'll do better. We'll be better. Things will get better. A lot of things are happening in life, in the world. I'm going back to work. I could point out all the things about how bad this life can seem, but we work hard, we making it for work, motion on everything.